welcome back everybody to the 100 baby completion challenge with Reg. He's back. In fact, the whole house is back. I'm so excited to finally be back in Oasis Springs. You have no idea. So, if you want to know what I've been doing for the past hour, I went around and I upgraded everything. Because for some reason, when you place a house somewhere, you lose all your upgrades. So I did that. Everything is spick and span. Nothing should break. Also, I did literally nothing. And we already have a green... Or just about green eco footprint. In Oasis Springs. Didn't have to do anything. Which is quite the drastic change. Compared to the entire eco lifestyle. And our entire experience in evergreen harbor but whatever i'm not gonna hold a grudge speaking of we need a new aspiration and i'm thinking i'm just gonna go back to what we were doing before eco lifestyle came out uh because we did we were halfway done with the angling ace aspiration um and then we got interrupted so i'm just gonna go back and do that and we need to finish the fish collection anyways. I had a really hard time looking for that for some reason. But yeah, we were on level two and we were like halfway done. We might as well finish it. We might as well get all the fish. Whatever. I realize a lot of them are actually, a lot of the ones that we don't have are actually in Granite Falls, which I haven't even been to yet. <laughs> I haven't even looked in that place's direction, so that'll be interesting. I know that there's a bunch of- it's all about camping and stuff. I've never- I've honestly never played it yet. I don't know what it is, but there's a couple of collections that are tied to that place. So, I'm going to catch what I can and then kind of leave that place for last just because it's going to open up Pandora's box of more collections that I have to think about in my head when we're still kind of in the middle of like seven. <laughs> and uh, I guess before we start the aspiration again, I'm gonna get her pregnant again because it's almost Star's- Oh, it is? It is Star's birthday. So we're running a little behind, aren't we? All right, you need to get out of here. Thank you. Thank you for your service. And you get to be hot-headed. Good luck with that. Alright, I got rid of Star. Hopefully she just gets pregnant with triplets and that solves our little backlog problem we have going on. Because uh, we haven't had just two kids in a very long time and Romeo ain't gonna cut it. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pursue that woman that I was going to pursue. But then I decided, you know what, let's just have sex with a guy that has a bag on his head. Um, actually it looks like she's gone. I don't know her anymore, and I don't remember her name, so I guess that's not gonna work. That kind of just shows how much I cared about my neighborhood in Evergreen Harbor, doesn't it? <laughs> I mean, I guess if we go out, we'll beat someone, right? We have to fish for three hours and then mount or bull five fish. We can kill them or we can enslave them. However I am feeling, I guess. Oh wow, there are fishing spots down here. That's interesting. I guess we can fish with bait, but all I have is vegetables and pineapples. Hopefully they like the citrus. Oh, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but <laughs> uh, every time I change her aspiration to a different type, I do change her everyday outfit to kind of represent that. If you did notice, I love you and you're great, but this one is like too ridiculous for me to not point out. She looks really silly. Alright, I guess while you're catching sea animals, I will go look for land animals for you. Uh, we got this guy who's showing off. Giving the uh, bird song. The mating ritual. We got these hard workers over here. Uh, we got Tetsu, of course. Tetsu is everywhere. No thanks to the vampire, but what about Baldi? 
You know, we've had a couple of male partners the last few times. I'm looking for a hot woman. Please provide. I mean, this is a person... She's got broken CC. I think it's her hair. Let me just, like... Um... She's a mermaid! Oh, man. We gotta make her look like a mermaid. I want her to be hot as fuck! And that's the power of CC, folks. Okay, Cleo, forget fish. We got a new one on our line. Okay. Oh, how, how does that- how does that work out? We're going fishing and we find a mermaid on complete accident. Meredith, let's do it. Just show off some shiny scales and she'll be into you no issue. <gasps> why? Oh, Meredith, why? All right, well, you got your 10 hours in. That's all I can ask for. Oh, it is midnight. I guess midnight is when mermaids go to sleep. Okay, well, she didn't catch anything new, so I'm just gonna murder these fish for the sake of the aspiration. Mount, mount, and mount. There we go! Look at that, that was so easy! I don't need these, though. We already have these. You could just sell them into the void. Alright, well, it's too late for Meredith to come over, so we'll have to deal with that tomorrow. But the rest of this aspiration... We have to catch fish, five fish using bait, and make six great catches. And we already have level 10 fishing skills, so... The rest is just history! Alright, this is a little OP. I wish I had known this three episodes ago. She has over 200 influence points. Jesus Christ! All right, she's here. Take a quick pick, tie her to the truck, bring her home. Oh yeah, now we're back in business. Oh, Meredith, blessed be the fruit. Please, give me that good news. Well, that was a fucking lie. Okay, wh why is this just a thing now? Why do they just stand outside my house and play with pottery? Just cause they can? Hey, look, guys. Back on my bullshit. Eating for two. Eating for four, hopefully. There better be triplets in there, Cleo. I swear to God, now is not the time to snooze. You know what? Now that that's taken care of, I kind of want to go camping. You know? Not even camping. I want to go glamping. I want to go have a ball. No, 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 we don't want to go to Selva Dorado. I think I said that right. We're gonna go to Granite Falls for the first time. I've never been here before. Yeah, let's spend the big bucks. We're going there. Oh, what if- Uh, I don't want to stay there too long, can I? I can leave whenever I want, right? Let's just do like- Let's do two. Almost two thousand dollars! Oh yeah, we just abandoned our children. Whatever. They, they didn't need to come. They got school. They, they can they can have fun at school, you know. Plus, we can meet some fine people here. All right, it's too cold for her to wear her get-up, apparently. So, she's just gonna wear her little sweater. And where can we fish? Oh, is it too cold to fish? How could you do this to me? Oh, right here. Can't fish in extreme cold. Oh, why? Oh, I just took a sleep. God damn it. I just took a sleep serum. What are we supposed to do? Have a vacation? This isn't what I wanted. Okay, what am I supposed to do? It's 1.15 in the a.m. And it's too cold to do anything. Well, what do you mean? You know what? Let's go appreciate this. I appreciate this. Cleo should appreciate it, too. Everyone appreciate this little moose man, please. Excuse me? That's a person in a bear costume? Can I- why? Why are you doing this? Do you work here? <gasps> little buggies. Collect those little buggies. We don't have 
any insects. Now we do. Look. Look, we're doing so much today. <gasps> Get it. That was a huge ladybug. That was gigantic! Holy shit! Go get these guys. Go get these guys. Look at them. Cleo. Have fun for once. Fuck. <gasps> Did you get it? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah, she really hates that it's raining. <laughs> She's actually kind of pissed off about it. I would be too. Dude, she's gonna get trench foot. Her foot's just gonna fall off. You know, now I'm very interested in the insects, even though I said that I wasn't going to open up a new collection. And now I've gone and done it anyways. <laughs> oh no. That's my pea brain going into overdrive. I rented this whole three, four bedroom cabin by myself. <laughs> Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I could have at least brought Romeo with us. What? Oh, what did I- What am I holding? Put that back. Oh look, the lottery! Again! Cleo. Thinking about winning some big bucks, are ya? Alright, the ice went away. But we still have pretty good energy levels, so we should be able to catch some good fishies. What? Who are you? <gasps> oh, look at him go. Look how fast he is. Cleo, I don't care what you're doing. This is more interesting. Dude, it's hammering. God is mad today. Did you just... What do you mean? You just completed it. And I wasn't even trying to complete it. Uh, yeah, they go pee. Is it the kids pushing on your bladder? Just pee outside. You're in the woods. It's fine. Nobody's gonna care or notice. Now she has to catch 20 different types of fish. Or she has to collect 20 types of fish. She already has eight. Uh, I can guarantee you if all of our fish were in her pocket, it would have counted. Oh no, we're gonna miss their birthday. We're on vacation- we went on vacation over the kids' birthdays. Oops. Gee, if only, like, <laughs> if only I brought them, this would have been fun for their birthday, don't you think? Who are you? Get out of here, I didn't invite you. No, 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 Cleo, you gotta put your- your- come on. Get into character now. We're in redneck country now, folks. You're gonna go shoot me a bear. What? What is that majestic thing? Huh. What is that? It looks like a lizard. What impossible creature is this? It, Cleo, it's bigger than your head. Please be careful. A dragon dragonfly. Okay. That thing looked disgusting. What? 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 Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, Cleo's in a Ghibli film. Stop fishing, please. Go get it. It's a dust spirit, Cleo. Where's Totoro? Oh, he's right over there. My bad. I missed him. What? What do you mean my vacation's over? Ah, I gotta go back to the real world? Ah, oh, I should have done the seven day one. Damn it. Oh, <laughs> oh no! No! Oh, I miss their birthdays. Oh, and she, now she hates children because of it. Oh, I screwed up. Oh, I'm so sorry, both of you. I'll bring you to the next vacation, I swear. Um, in terms of what she got, the only new thing she got is this crawdaddy. This red crawdad. He can go on the wall, right next to everybody else. 
And then these insects that I have no idea what, where I'm gonna put. Uh, we're gonna need more tables. More stupid looking buffet tables to put the insects on. Great. What? Ho what? Paper discovered the fire. Fluffy. Fluffy. It's coming from the toilet? Can I ask? Why? How? Okay, I mean, we've seen weirder things, I guess. <laughs> I guess I don't need an explanation for anything anymore. What? 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 Why? So please, if I use if I use this toilet, please I need to investigate. Use the toilet, Cleo. Okay, walk in on me. What? Do, uh, what? Do my kids just have flammable shit? What? Okay, I really want her to go and fish again so that we can finish this desperation. But I have a feeling as soon as we leave the house, she's gonna go into labor. I just, uh, that's just the way it goes. Catch that big boy! Oh, he's gone. Right there, right there! Catch that big boy! Who dis? Cleo's reeled in the butterfly fish, which is endangered. Yeah. I've already went through this. If I don't want to have it, it needs to go in my little pocket, okay? No real reason why I shouldn't. You think I care? You think I care? I saved Evergreen Harbor, okay? That's different from Solani. This is exactly what I said would happen. I knew she would go. Okay, she made it like a few hours, but I knew she would let me down. And I also didn't think of any baby names again. I'm gonna give them fishy ocean names. Fit for the occasion. Oh, please add triplets, please add triplets, please add triplets. Please. A baby girl. Oh, yes, a girl mermaid. She used to be Pearl, because that's adorable. Okay. Another girl. Well, I'm fresh out of names. Cloyster. Cloyster. Damn it all. No triplet. And another. Uh. Are we cursed? Is our house cursed? What the heck? You know, I'm pretty sure what it is. It's probably an an upgrade with eco lifestyle that I put on the toilets. Uh, I would much rather just buy new toilets. <laughs> That's kind of annoying. Okay, yeah, it it's some upgrade that I put on it. Oh, they all have it though. Why can't I just take it off? It's an upgrade with eco lifestyle where you can compost your um, duty and but if you don't empty the toilet before they use it, it will always catch fire. <sighs> so now I gotta re-upgrade all my toilets. That's like four. You know what? Forget the pole. Forget this rain. I'm going scuba diving. Yeah, yeah. Let's go back to our primitive ancestry. Get the fish with our bare hands, Cleo. We're playing Survivor today. You found a guppy? Hold on a second. A guppy is not gonna cut it. Okay. It's not gonna cut it. Oh, you can scuba dive for seashells and treasure too. Oh, it looks like spear fishing is actually gonna take a lot longer than regular fishing. But you know, when you're not a mermaid yourself, and you need to be a mermaid role model for your mermaid kids, what else can you do? Oh, you can fish in this boat? You can fish in this boat? Are you kidding? I didn't know that. Are you actually gonna catch something? 
<gasps> That's a big boy. A tuna! Cleo, okay, whatever you do, do not get out of this boat. Alright. If you get out of the boat, you're gonna die. I didn't account for this. I really- I just catch one more fish, please. Cleo, no! Cleo! Oh, no, 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 please. Oh! Oh! Cleo! Hey! Why you gonna do that now? Can you come- like- Uh... Oh, no! What? <laughs> I told you not to get out of the boat! Oh my god, Cleo died away from home. Her urn is at key point. Oh. I haven't saved. I haven't saved, so this is canon. <laughs> Oh, what does that mean? Uh-oh. Oh, Cleo, now you've really gone and done it, dude. Now you've really gone and done it. <laughs> Why? Are you good, dude? Please, can you go get your mom? God damn it. <laughs> okay is right. <laughs> God fucking damn it. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, well, um, I guess this is the end of the challenge. Fucking psych, dude! That's if I cared about rules. I don't give a shit about rules. Now to bring her back, I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna end the episode off here. Uh, I was hoping she'd be able to finish the aspiration, but I guess she's never going to now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so I guess I'll fix this. <laughs> I guess I'll just fix this problem. <laughs> and then I'll see you guys, hopefully, in the next <laughs> episode. <sighs> Goodbye.